the 2021 NRL Finals have arrived and with that brings a week full of team showcase videos starting with the minor premiers the Melbourne Storm taking on the Manly Warringah Sea Eagles. Can we beat the Storm on max settings in Rugby League Life 4? Let's find out. Oi, boys, welcome, welcome to another video on the channel. Before we jump into the gameplay, let's go over the settings. I think I will bump up the minutes, so we'll change it to nine minutes. That should be more than enough time. I think it'll make the injuries a little more difficult to deal with, but we'll see how we go. So the game, I believe, is supposed to be played at Sunshine Coast Stadium, but obviously it's not in the game, so we'll be playing it at Melbourne. It's supposed to be a Melbourne home game anyway, as we take a look at the lineup here. I just went with what both teams would typically go for. It was a little more difficult to do Melbourne because we don't know where Nico Hines would play if he would even be in the team. I was pretty much just guesstimating. Also, Manly's bench, I wasn't too sure. But it should be a good game this weekend, man. I can't wait for the I can't wait for the NRL finals to kick off. Oh, and also, last but not least, shout out to the gang if you're watching this right now be sure to hit up that comment section with the hash tag odd squad now let's run it all right let's see if we can get this dub here with manly against melbourne on max settings they come down the short side here it's the fox gets away oh he goes for the offload they'll get it back though melbourne let off the hook after throwing a terrible pass, we get driven into touch. Oh, look at the run by Dale Finucane. Straight through the middle. Takes two to pull down Jesse Bromwich. It's our first goal line defense test of the day. Oh, get up. And they get past us with ease through Ryan Pappenhausen. I mean, what are you even doing in that situation? They had Pappenhausen on top for four Sipley. Forward pass, we'll take it. The massive hits on tour for four simply. Oh, we almost scored a cheesy try there. Can we score in the corner? No. Ooh, what was that pass? Nico Hines. We'll take it though. We'll take it. <coughs> Marty Tapel. Need we need better runs than that. Beautiful ball. Tom Trebojevic. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Short side. Oh, we tried just Steam rolling through the middle. All right, here we go. Well defended. Not sure if Tip by more at all will be playing. I mean, they've got so much options for their bench. Be interesting to see who they actually go with. They keep coming down this left, this left edge. Kenny Bromwich is easily wrapped up here. As we put the hit on, that's more like it. To Pal gets us the ball. Beautiful hit. We rarely see that on Legend. I guess it was just perfectly timed. As we get the ball away to Foreign. Man, it's so hard to come up with a play. As we float one out wide. Garrick, stay in. Clear him. Five. Oh. There it is. First try of the match for Manly will be Jake Trebojevic. I actually thought the game screwed us on the last play because the receivers are all over the place. The decoy runners, like look at this. It was just a miss, but we managed to get the ball out to Jake Trebojevic. We may as well make some changes right here. It's all for four simply for Paseca. Uh, Jake's getting a little gassed himself. I might wait a bit till we bring Walker on. And we'll make the two points for sure here as we tie it up. With 13 remaining in the first half. Alright, so the stamina is actually not as badly affected as I thought it would be. I thought because uh, cause the minutes were increased, they would get tired. The longer they stay on, but I guess, I guess we're wrong. 
Ooh, thankfully it went backwards. Someone pick it up. Jeez. As we take a closer look at the stats here, 57, 43% time position in our favor. We made one error. I mean, also decent, also decent half. We didn't miss that many tackles, only seven missed tackles. All right, so Jake definitely needs a spell here. So we'll pull him off Schuster as well for Carl Lawton. Yeah, speaking of trying to get Turbo involved, it is tough to get your fullback in, your fullback in general some ball. I mean, there's one, maybe two plays that cater to your fullback that you can set up, but other than that, they're usually just chilling behind the ruck. Oh, look, Awato's looking a little gas though. He's been pretty solid for us this game. Here we go. Here we go. <sighs> Ruben Garrick. Didn't have the pace to get away. We'll try a little chip kick for Tommy. Oh, it's not going to go for Tom. That's tough. Second. Foreign. We're going to look for Parker. Nico Hines, man. It's hard to get past him. They do look short here. Here we go. Garrick, a high tackle. Ooh, the, the decision, the decision. Do we go for the two points? Oh, you're kidding. Can't believe that actually almost worked. Beautiful dummy out of, out of dummy half Lachlan Croker. A classic cheesy play, but we'll take the points. Look at this, dummies to the right, and it opens up. Oh man, Operation Get Turbo the Ball has not been going well. We may as well take it from here. <laughs> Why not? There we go, Marty. The big run, a little in and away from Pappenhausen. Oh no. Thank you. Captain save him. Tom Trebojevic wraps up Pappenhausen. Beautiful stuff right there. 12 for 4 Sipley. On his toes. Gets us the ball. There we go. Tom Trebojevic. He is gassed. It doesn't matter. He will make it. No, he doesn't. He falls short. Here we go. Chez. Down the line. Wide. Oh, beautiful Brad Parker. That was, uh, that was pretty silky, not gonna lie. We'll take another look here. We just shifted down the line, simple stuff, until it found Parker. Remus in no man's land. This is easily one of our better performances on max settings. So we take the kick here. We finally got uh, Chaboy. Oh, no. Will that make it? Yep, no, it won't. Inside the final two minutes, Melbourne. Looking for a consolation try here. Justin Nolan. Wrapped up just outside the 30. Oh, who's this? Harry Grant straight through. Of course, Tom Trebojevic is there to wrap him up. Final seconds of the match. Siren sounds, and that's it. Full time. We come away with the win with Manly against the Melbourne Storm on max settings. 16 points to 6. John Tavojevic picking up man of the match. Oh, let's take a look at the stats here. Let's take a look at his stats in particular. What warranted us that man of the match? He had 9 runs for 97 meters. Uh, look at that. 10 tackles. 1 missed tackle. 2 line breaks. Oh, four line breaks, two tackle busts. Pretty solid. And we will wrap it up there, boys, as always. If you enjoyed that and would like to see more Rugby League Live 4 content, be sure to run a straight at that like button, subscribe to the channel. If you're new, thank you for tuning in, and I'll see you, you, you.